everybody, I'm at my new spot right now, man. I'm way out here in Nevada, Texas. Well, actually, Nevada. Nevada, Texas is where I'm at right now. So we just drove from Canton, Texas, all the way over here now, man. That was like another hour and a half drive from one side all the way to the other side, man. Going through Roy City, Faith, all them damn me little old small counties, man. So now I done finally, I done finally made it here, guys. Finally made it here. So this is all I got right here, y'all. What we see right here, this is all I got. I got nothing more, nothing less. That's it right there. Garbage, 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 garbage. Tons of it. Half piece cars, full cars. A little bit of everything, man. Everything. All right, let me see if I can make me some room here. And boy, y'all, man, we end up stopping halfway here. End up going to down me Soul Man's Barbecue. Man, y'all, tell me why I end up spending 27 damn me dollars in the damn me plate. Just for my damn me self, man. I had one of those big old, um, uh, one of those big old double barrel loaded baked potatoes with fully loaded, I mean fully loaded, I had like two different kinds of meat on them, then I had got, what, uh, uh like two, two hot link sandwiches, man boy, now everybody wanna call me a fat ass <laughs> boy, man, I be spending too much money, man, on lunch way much, way too much money, more money than I really want to spend be honest with you, honest with you guys. Way more money than what I wanted to spend. But it was all right, man. It was all right, man, because, boy, they had some good-looking women up off in there. That's all I can say. Man, they had some good-looking women up off in there. All righty. Now I got to see if this, I got to see if you can get up off in here now. What we gotta try to do, y'all hold up. All right, so I'm gonna show you guys right quick, man, how I set up my crusher, how the cylinders go up, and how I just operate everything to set it all up in one in one uh, one motion. So basically, y'all already know how I set up my, I mean, how I start up my crusher. So y'all already know that. So basically, what I do is, man, after I finish starting it up, go ahead and rev up the motor. So as I rev up the motor, I would take these two handles right here, this one and this one right here, and they would actually start lifting up my cylinders all the way up. So after they go all the way up, I would actually push my locking pin in. So all what I do, I will push it down, and then I will push these handles again, and they would lock, and they would lock the big old pins right there in place. As y'all can see, it doesn't give me much space between these cars and my crusher. Does not give me a lot of space at all, man. But I'll make it work. I will make it work. Now I know everybody's probably been uh asking if I'm gonna use that uh the Al John Crusher. The Al John Crusher is not for me, y'all. It's for another crushing crew of ours that we have. Because uh, boss man just bought another one, so that makes 
So that makes crusher number six that we have. So that's what that makes there. Hold up, I got some on the glass. So yeah, it, it's not made for me. You know what I mean? I was just uh I was just seeing if he actually bought it or not because another crew they were using it for a while, I guess until something had happened. So right now they're taking it, right now it's going to the shop to actually uh to actually see what was wrong with it, you know, when they was using it, something that happened, but I don't really know. So but yeah, I won't be really too much just using that one at all. Like the only time I'll probably use that one there, maybe if that crushing crew didn't come in or something like that, that'd be the only time I'll probably use that uh that crusher there. So all these cars here, y'all man, they don't have nothing on them. Only thing they really got is just a little bitty gas tank, that's it. And shh, ain't really nothing in them at all either. Boy. Man, 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 man. Man. Man, so check this out here. So today we driving, and all of a sudden, I see this damn me Wagoneer. So I was like, man, what the hell is up wrong with me? What's up with this Wagoneer? Why does it look so funny looking? So I looked it up. I looked it up to see how much it costs. So they have, so they have two different versions, two different versions of these Wagoneers. They have the uh, the regular version Wagoneer, then they got the Grand Wagoneer. So when I went to go look up the Grand Wagoneer, tell me why is it they want almost a hundred thousand dollars for a goddamn me Grand Wagoneer? I'm, I, I'm not I'm not finna spend. I'm not finna spend a hundred thousand dollars on no goddamn me car, y'all. I mean, seriously, man, I'm just not. Cause that's a hundred thousand dollars. I could be putting on me a damn me house, or I could be building me a house some damn me where. You know what I mean? I mean, or, or some type of investment or something, man. I mean, I don't, I don't really see myself spending a hundred thousand dollars on no goddamn car, man. Because within, maybe within a. Uh, Maybe within a uh, uh, couple of years from now, guess what I'll be doing? I'll probably be crushing them by then. So that, that don't make no sense, man, to spend that much money on a car that's not going to last that long. Just like the, 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 just like how some of these people end up buying these damn BMWs and Mercedeses. And then 10 years later down the road, well, guess what? They got sold as a damn big junk car. Cause they didn't want to spend all the money to get it fixed. So why the hell did you even buy it in the first damn big place? I mean, shh. I mean, I understand people want to ride in luxury, but don't be out to a rabbit ass mind, man, putting yourself in that much goddamn me trouble for a damn me car just so you can ride good. Man, come on now, come on. For real. I tell you, man, people just be going crazy over these damn me things, man. They be going crazy. I just don't see myself doing that at all. Ooh, man, it is really human real. Damn, it's humid as hell out here. Shit. Alright, give me another. Let me put that one more on top of right quick. Y'all give me that shit in. Man, there's one thing I love about my job is that I get to travel to different places when I'm not stuck in one place. But the only thing I do really hate is the goddamn me long ass one hour, two hour drives, y'all. That's what I really hate, man. I mean, it's like... It's like being on a damn me airplane, man. You get jet lagged. You don't want to do anything. Then I then I have to run around here to pump myself up, man. Y'all should see some of the stuff I have to do, y'all, just to just to pump myself up, man. Just so I can, you know what I mean? Just so I can uh, keep it going, man. <laughs> Mario be looking at me like I done lost my rabbit ass mind. I bet Mario like that dude right there. He is crazy, man. How you gonna run around? Or how you gonna run around? and get yourself pumped up just like that. Well, man, hey, I, I gotta do what I gotta do, man, to keep myself going. Cause as soon as I don't, that's when you kind of fall off. But I wouldn't, I wouldn't say just, you know, like, fall off, fall off, not like that. Man, we got a little bit of everything up off of here, man. Just a little bit of everything. Oops. Nah, I wasn't even trying to do that at all. So 
because I really don't have too much of a big old space, so I gotta, gotta work with what I got here. Like I say, man, I done been, I done been in tired of places than this. I mean, way, way tighter. This ain't nothing to compare to some of the places where I've been at. This is like, this right here is like an eight walk right here. Man, but man, y'all know what? Like I say, Mario, he ain't got to too much to do nothing. Besides just make a hole in the gas tank. But 90% of them don't even have gas up in them at all, period. I see I got some Range Rovers here. Got You got Infinities, them like a Kia Soul. Man. Whoa, I see a lot of cars here, man. See, I see a couple. I see a whole bunch of half ones sitting up there on top. I got to pick up this stuff down here if I end up catching them blowout. Expensive ass cars that won't even last you 20 years. A hundred fifty, a hundred sixty thousand dollar goddamn me Range Rover. Shoot. It's garbage. It's garbage within 12 years max. Garbage. Some may last a little bit longer. It all depends on how you take care of the car, man. That's what it's all based on. Seriously. Cause I mean, if you take care of your car like you do your wife, then it'll last long. But then if you don't, if you dog the bitch out, then guess what? She gonna be like another dog. She gonna get up and leave you for another day. Simple as that. So y'all, I didn't tell y'all, man. So I had a conversation with Candace, right? So Candace threw this. Uh, Candace threw this. Can I move? Can I move in your place? face in my uh stuff in my face i was like oh hell no man hell no look woman i look woman i cut for you a whole lot i like you a lot but man uh g mac he's not with that right now man g mac is enjoying his freedom that's what g mac is doing right now he's enjoying that freedom man just for the time being just for the time being man i mean hey I'm enjoying the little, the little sneak peeks and the and the and the and the little sides and you know what I'm saying. I'm enjoying all that, man. I'm enjoying everything. I mean, you're supposed to enjoy that. You know, I mean, don't get me wrong. You know, being in a relationship is cool or whatever. But you know, I, I'm just, I, I'm just not with that right now, y'all. I'm really, not, I'm just not with that at all, man. I mean, I rather just. I'd rather just, just be single, that way I could just mingle and just be done with it, you know what I mean? Because, I mean, this. Woo! I mean, man, this. These days. These days, man, sometimes, y'all, it is havoc with a chick sometimes, man. It really is. I mean, it be havoc sometimes with a chick. Y'all give me one second, I got to adjust something. Yeah, y'all, like I say, man, I, I, I'm, I'm just, like I say earlier, man, I'm just, I'm, I'm just enjoying, I'm just enjoying that free time, y'all. Just enjoying that free time, because we already know, once you get your chick moving your house, oh, it's all over with now. She wants to make all the rules and this and that, and do all this, and want to go here, and want to go there, and do this, and I'm like, little mama, I don't mind at all. I don't mind it all, but you know, I'm just, you know, I just love that single life, man. Don't have to answer to anybody. Don't have to worry about any damn thing at all. But, you know, I mean, like I say, it's, it's, man, it's all cool and gravy, man. It's all cool and gravy. I remember a while back, I remember a while back, I remember, uh, Brittany, she asked me the same damn me thing, same thing. Can I move in with you? No, 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 You know what I'm saying? I mean, yeah, I'm a cool ass guy. You know what I'm saying? I like, you know, I like to do stuff. I'm a venturous person, you know, but man, I just love my freedom, y'all. I'm sorry, but I love my freedom. But don't get me wrong. I love Pooh Nanny just as much as I love money, too. Oh, man, it is getting mighty moist up off in here. 
boy. Because I'm so close to the damn me crush, I got to close the door and open up the back window. Uh, you guys won't be able to hear a damn word I'm saying. Come on, come on. Go down, don't wait. Just waiting on. Thanksgiving to Christmas, Mario. Which one are you waiting on, man? It'll be a long time for one of them get here. Yeah, so it's like four cars, y'all, to each bundle here, man. Cause they ain't got nothing on them. No motor, no transmission. Maybe just a suspension, maybe a door or two. That's about it. That's about it. I don't know, I know some of these bundles. I know some bundles I'll probably end up putting like five cars or something like that. I know I will end up doing it. Cause I already know, man, we're not gonna be here that long cause this ain't gonna be too long of a video here, you know? But damn, today is payday and I'm trying to head back to Dallas since I'm way out here. Which I remember, which I remember coming out here some, uh, I think it's about, a, I think it's been about a year since I've been out here to this guy place here. But these guys, they don't really crush, they don't really crush this often like they do. But when they do, they end up crushing a lot of cars at one damn many time. You know, they'll probably end up crushing like six or seven loads or something like that. Just like now, uh, I was supposed to go up there to Greenville, but I wasn't I wasn't done where I was at. So they sent another crew up there. So another crew up there is crushing 40 loads, y'all. 40 loads. That is a lot. That is a lot. Y'all hold up. Man, that damn bundle right there, y'all, is tall as hell, man. I had to tell Mario, man, hey, we got to jog that again, baby. We got to take that down some more. Damn, y'all. This damn thing right here got some weight on it, man. Just for not to be having no damn emotion. But that, man, they stuck the shit out of this damn Range Rover, man. Boy, they stuck the shit out of it. All right, there. Yeah, we go right there, Mario. Right there, so. All right, all right. Let's see what else I can grab. Make a little small bundle with this here. So I guess I grab a couple of these here, little bitty ones, and maybe a half on the so. Stop that baby up, man. I love my cars like this, y'all. I love them like this. It is so easy. You don't have to deal with a lot of stuff, man. Woo! Cause it be sometimes, y'all. I'm not even gonna lie. Sometimes, man. I, I mean, I love, I, I love making my side hustle, but I hate. Sometimes I hate breaking out these motors, y'all, because they make so much of a goddamn mess. And then it takes too damn me long just to drop them all too also when you're trying to drop them from the um, um, from the suspension, you know what I mean? So it takes a... It, it, <sighs> but, you know, I mean, I'm not complaining about the situation. Not one bit, man. I'm really not. It goes with the job. It comes with the territory, you know? I mean, if you don't like what you do, then get the hell up out the kitchen. Simple as that. I love what I do. I love what I do, man. I take pride in what I do crushing these cars, especially the classics, man. Especially them classics. I love giving some death row sentences. I love it. I love it, y'all. God knows I'm just going to probably crush a few cars, and man, that's going to be about it. We're going to get on back to the beat time. Go ahead and crush that one since it's already there. Yeah, so the last so so the last place I was just at, man, I had a load that I made that was almost eighty-six thousand pounds, y'all. Six thousand pounds over the well over the limitation, y'all. But, I mean, I didn't get bitched out about it, so that's a good thing right there. So I guess the boss man, he must have loved it. Because he didn't be like, gee, what the hell did I tell you, man? But it's all right. Come on, no, 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 do not flip over. Come on now.
tell me, but they be stuffing the hell out of these cars, man. That's money talking, baby. That is money talking. She's talk, talk. So now, after Candace done hit me back, y'all, with this, can I stay with you? She, <laughs> she just called me right back talking about, hey, I'm coming over tonight. I'm coming over tonight. She's talking about, I'm not leaving till the next morning. Well, then I guess it looks like, I guess it looks like you're going to be mighty busy then. That's what that means. That's what that's telling me. It's like you're going to be busy. So, is that what you want to do then? Hey, be my guest. So, all I can say is just be my guest, woman. Because I got a job for you. But yeah, man, I don't know what it is with me, but I'm always, I, I'm, I'm always finding these really throwed off ass chicks, man. I mean, but you know, they cool as hell, you know what I mean? I mean, they just like, I mean, they, they cooler than a fan on high. Let's just put it like that, man. They cooler than a fan on high, y'all. But I just seem, I, I just seem to attract the, the throwed off crazy ones. I, I can't. I can't seem to, uh, I can't seem to find me a normal one. I can't seem to find one of those. I always end up finding the ones that want to burn you with hot fish grease and pennies and, and clothes hangers and all kind of other shit. You know what I mean? So, you know what I mean? Y'all know what, y'all, <laughs> I mean, I'm pretty sure y'all know what that shit is like, man. I'm pretty sure y'all do. So don't, so don't act like you don't know because I know one of y'all, one of y'all probably had a homie who done been through that where his old lady, his old lady done scarred his ass for life. But I'm not with that shit, man. I'm not with uh I'm, I'm not with being burnt with uh hot grease and pennies and clothes hangers and shit. That's just not my cup of tea, y'all. That's just not my cup of tea. Now somebody else, they can have that, but I don't want it. I do not want it, man. I don't wanna wake up in the middle of the night with fish grease and hot pennies stuck to my goddamn back and chest. Oh man, that will be, that will, that, that will be a messed up sight right there. That will be pretty messed up right there. Don't try to think, <laughs> damn. <laughs> Wake up with hot pennies on your stomach and back. Ooh wee, oh boy. I got my first three bundles already and I'm already running out of room, y'all. I gotta find me another spot to put these bundles in now. I'm gonna see how much I'm gonna see how much shit talking she gonna be talking tonight. That's wrong. That's what we are gonna find out tonight. We are gonna find out and see how much shit talking she doing. Let's see how real she is. I mean, I know she got it up in there. I know that for a fact. I don't seen that firsthand. I want to see what she got one on one. See what I want to see there. may talk a lot of good game, but actions speak louder than words. We all know that. Yeah, it's just like my work. It speaks for itself. I don't need to speak for it. Oh, boy, boy, boy. But you know what, man? That's going to be it, guys. Y'all stay up and I stay up. Peace.